Hey everyone, welcome back to another The Maury's Plays Let's Play of Animal Crossing New Leaf. We're just going to pop this weed right out of the dirt there. We're probably going to have a few weeds, actually. We haven't seen any in a while. This, to me, makes me think there's going to be a gem hiding in here. So we'll just grab our shovel. Yay! Ooh, is that a silver? Silver nugget, nice. We'll take that. Today, we're going to probably focus solely on the campsite area and design it. I have already just joined the path up here. You haven't missed anything. I just quickly joined the path up because it's a bit tedious watching someone lay patterns, especially in New Leaf. So I just joined them up, but we're probably going to extend it up to the plaza, maybe, at some point. But we're just going to maybe bring some flowers over here, move some trees, maybe get another, another public work project here. So... It, the clock isn't all by itself. Um, so yeah, let's take a look around here. We should be able to complete the path now because we just moved the campsite back a tile, which means when there's an igloo here or a tent, it shouldn't disturb the patterns here um, because usually it's okay when it's just the campsite, but then if a building or a campsite is put there, like when there's a visitor, it makes one of the spaces disappear like outside of the buildings, which is quite annoying. Um, and also, I just moved these stumps here because I thought it's quite cool um, having the stumps near the campsite. It's quite, it's quite neat and it keeps them out of the way. It means no villagers will move in on top of them. So that's kind of cool. Uh, let me know what you think about that. But yeah, we're going to kind of focus on this, this area and maybe we could extend the path up to the plaza, something like that. Um, we're pretty much in line with the center of the plaza, so it's not too bad. Um, okay, so I guess we should... Let's go and have a look at the public works projects first. Hey, Dizzy, but fishing over the bridge. I'm not sure. Oops, I just scared you fishing. I'm so sorry. Oh, and here we go. Oh, we've got another white uh, pansy, some new hybrids. How is there an orange one there? Must be from these two. Uh, okay, we've got some more orange ones. I was kind of hoping for some other ones but i'm guessing we need more um white pansies but this should be enough to work with for now there we go um i don't think we can't plant one here unfortunately uh, no we can't we can't even dig on these two tiles here so uh where should we put this extra orange pansy hmm maybe we could place it just here and then we can put the rest of the white one. We're gonna have to move these fruit trees. It's no good. Uh, and in order to move them, it means chopping them down and, and planting some more. Okay, we're just doing a bit of flower arranging, rearranging at the moment. We want to maximize the amount that can breed with each other. So we've got quite a few white ones next to white ones now, so we might be able to get some different ones. Um, what else have we got here? Some random yellow ones out of sync. So we'll put this one up here. It's so easy to get the, the orange pansies. There we go. Okay, maybe we'll water them a little later. Um, but first, let's go and have a look at the public works projects and see what is best fitting for the campsite area. Uh, looks like we've got some meow coupons as well. Hey, Claudia. How are you? Good morning, Maury. You're up early, aren't you, coffee? So what did you want, Maury? Uh, what's the latest? So I borrowed something from Lobo. I should have returned long ago, coffee. I wonder, Maury, would you mind returning it for me? I'm a little too busy to take it over myself. Sure. Thanks for helping out, Maury. I'll just turn this over to you then. What is it? Oh, and one more thing. Deliver it before the end of the day, okay? Sure thing. Okay, let's go and speak to Isabel. We'll grab our coupons on the way past. Perfect. Um, that's a lot of coupons. We must have done um, an achievement without realizing. Probably something to do with planting flowers. Hey Isabel, let's initiate a new public works project. Hi Mayor Mori, is there something I can help you with? Public works projects. If you want to work on a public works project, I'm happy to help. What would you like to work on? Um, now Jay yesterday <laughs> added a or requested a road sign of some description, a traffic sign. 
But maybe we're thinking of something for the camping area. Something small. Not the balloon arch. Oh, I love the fence. I can't wait to put that somewhere. The, the, oh, a traffic signal. Was that what was requested? I can't remember. Uh, oh, caution sign. Um, I mean, maybe we could have the well. The water well is kind of cute. And it would go with camping. If someone's camping, they might need a supply of water. Um, yeah, let's go with the, the well. Would you like to start work on the water well project? Let's do it. Yay, let's go find a place to build. Okay. Okay, Mayamori, please lead me to the spot where you'd like to place the water well. Okay, well, we want it somewhere near the campsite. I'm, I'm thinking inside the little area that we've kind of cordoned off with the path. We've created a little kind of garden area here. Um, we'll probably end up moving these trees a little. Um, let's just check there's... Oops. Just check there's nothing in here. Oh my goodness, I hope bees don't attack while we're with Isabel. That wouldn't be very uh, a good sight, would it? <laughs> oh, a perfect peaches tree has grown. Yes. Okay, that's awesome. Um, right, let's have a think about this. Do we just, like, put it in the middle? Uh, what do you think? Maybe it's too close to the river. Let's see. Yes, I think it'll be perfect. Let's have a look at just how close it is to the actual river. Kind of want it a bit central. It'll probably look something like this when it's all finished. Oh, no. We need it one tile over. Uh, gotta think this over. Maybe one tile over and one tile in, maybe. Oh, my. Is there something you don't like about it? Well, if you find another good spot, let me know. Okay, let's one tile over... Let's try here. What do we think about having the well here? Hmm, the campsite might be in the way. No. Uh, don't you think placing it here won't work? From where you're standing now, Mayor, we need an empty section of land that's two left and right. And another three back. However, if it's going to be something else, we best have extra space on all sides. So when Isabel gives us the measurements, that's not including extra space around the campsite. So we need effectively three tiles. So one around the campsite, then the two left or right. So it can only be on this one. Uh, okay, what about here? Isabel, come closer. Come close. Come close. There we go. Let's see. I think it will be perfect. It's going to be too close to the path again, isn't it? Oh, no. That is perfect. That's exactly where we want it. We're going to lose a tree. But that's okay. We can plant new trees. In fact, we need to go to Leaf anyway. Uh, we need to try and buy some bushes and stuff. I don't know if that's from Leaf or maybe we'll have to go to the island or something. Uh, what do you think? Is this the spot? Yeah, this works well. We could... Yeah, we could work with that. Maybe there's space to put a bench there as well at some point. Uh, understood. Well, let's go ahead and start the needed preparations. All set to help us gather donations to fund the water well is our helpful town gyroid Lloyd. It's going to be hard to wait for all the donations to arrive, so we'll have uh, to our water well. Sorry. Uh, well, I must return to the town hall. Ah, you don't need to worry about making the trip back, Mayor. Okay, then. I'll be taking my leave. Okay, pretty good. That, but it's bigger, isn't it? I think it just looks smaller because it's kind of a circle in a square. So it, look, it looks like it's small, but it actually does take up four tiles. Um, okay, maybe we should chop this tree down so we can have a bit of a think. Where is my axe? There we go. Hopefully we don't find a special stump, although that would be cool. No. Okay, we'll dig this up. I'm thinking maybe we should plant... Oh, we haven't got enough space to do... I was hoping we could get one tree and two trees here. There's not going to be enough space, is there? Maybe just the... Maybe we could just put one here, so it's kind of opposite the clock. Oh, I'm thinking maybe we should have shifted it over once, and then we could have had another tree... There. Maybe we could do that at a later date. Okay, should we plant another perfect peach tree near the campsite? I'm thinking. Hopefully it grows. Um, berry. There we go. And I don't know if this does anything. 
But we're going to water it anyway, just in case, because you never know. Okay, while I remember, I think before we start moving flowers over here, we should plant our fertilizer. You have to bury it in the ground. So thank you for everyone that let me know. You have to bury it. So let's um, see if we can bury the fertilizer here. There we go. I think that's what we do. And I, again, I don't know if we need to water it. So we'll just water it just in case. Lobo, why can't we water this fertilizer? There we go. Hey. Yo, Maury, just who I wanted to run into. I thought it was going to be bored today. Hey, I'm thinking about playing a little hide and seek right now. Just be warned, if you think hide and seek is something that's only for kids, you're dead wrong. It's a very intellectual game where... Uh, the it and those hiding try to read each other's minds. What do you think? Feel up to playing with us? Sure, we'll have a quick game. It'll only take a couple of minutes. He, and then he, don't cry like a baby once I beat you. And then we actually need to talk to Lobo anyway because we've got the present for him. And also, then we can focus on the flowers afterwards. Okay, so we've got Jay and the wolf pack. All right, listen up. Okay, we'll all go and hide somewhere here in town. If you manage to find all three of us within 15 minutes. Ooh, is that more than usual? Then you're the undisputed winner. Ha, we won't be hiding inside any buildings, so you only need to look for us outside. Well, let's get started already. Set, go. Okay. 15 minutes quite a long time. We could just casually carry on with what we're doing. Um, they're not going to be behind the campsite, are they? Um, I hope they're not hiding behind the cafe because we can't actually get behind there now since we moved it. They'd be in the river. <laughs> um, ooh, a fossil. Wait, is that someone there? No. They're usually just literally behind the houses. I haven't ever seen them behind the town hall yet. Where are you? I feel like we should be digging these fossils up as well. Look, I dug up a fossil! And then we've got the question of what flowers do we want near the cafe? Maybe tulips? We've got plenty of tulips. Another weed? Okay, this is a little bit more tricky than usual. Are they hiding behind trees or something? We haven't seen... Oh, there's Jay. Found you. Whoa, nice job, Rory. I didn't think you'd find me. There's still two hiders out there. They're uh, like hide-and-seek ninjas. Um, let's start picking up the flowers as we see them as well. I think we'll go with some tulips. would be nice. Okay, we're nearly out of buildings. Uh, grab these tulips. Having all the flowers in one location as well is, is it makes it easier to manage. Look, I dug up a fossil. Especially since we haven't got the beautiful ordnance on. It means uh, we can water them all in the same place. Okay, they must be up near Wolfling's house. Where are you? Oh, they might be behind Tech's house. His house is right out of the way. Oh, you are hiding behind a tree. Huh? How did you find me? I thought I'd find the perfect hiding spot in Moriland. It's too soon for you to feel totally relieved, Mori. There's one person for you to seek. And boy, are we seeking. And also, thanks for the ideas for using bamboo and bushes for fences and that. I can't wait to start doing that. Um, as soon as we find a bamboo tree. Oh no, are they wilted? Oh dear. Another fossil. Oh no, I can't swap it. I mean, I can't carry it. We'll just bury it again. 
Okay. Oh no, I can't pick up. Of course, I forgot we've picked up loads of flowers, haven't we? Um. Okay, let's drop the fossils in here. Okay, this is a bit tricky. Where's the last person? I can't believe there's a chance we might not find them. Oh, there you are. Ah, oh, you find me already, girl. This is kind of frustrating. Oh man, I didn't expect to lose against you back there. You've got a better, Maury. To reward your unexpected victory, I'll send you something nice a bit later. So check your mail. No problem. Here you go. I've got something for you as well. Hey, hey, Maury. So you got something you want to say to me? Delivery. A delivery for me. Yeah, here we go. Two Lobo. Ah, maybe this is the thing I sent Claudia a while ago, or I lent to Claudia a while ago. Uh, so it's nice of Claudia to wrap something up before returning it. This is what makes her so special. So then, what do you think's inside? Probably a shirt. If you can guess right, I'll give you something nice. Flor it's going to be clothing, isn't it? Flooring, wallpaper, clothing, food. Ooh, food. Or furniture. I'm going to go clothing. So, your guess is something along the lines of clothing, right? Well, let's open it and find out. Yay! It's always clothing. You got it. It's clothing. As I promised, you get a prize. Oh, what? I get to keep it. I wish I'd have gone for furniture then in case it was based on what you selected. I know you just bought me the uh, tan dog tooth shirt, but you can consider it a gift. I don't need it anymore. Anyway, Maury, thanks for finding me. Oh, no worries. Thanks for playing. Okay, so back on track. Let's see. Hmm. This might not be the best place to grow hybrids, but it could work. Maybe we'll have to think this tree situation through. We might have to, uh... We might have to move the tree. Once again, if we do a little grid pattern like this, kind of maximizing our chances, I think. I'm pretty sure it works diagonally. Um, I mean, next to each other probably works as well, but I think this is just increases the maximum chances. Give them a bit of water. I love the subtle change when a flower's water. You can just see it get a little shine. Right, and maybe, maybe we can do the same this side. How many flowers have we got on us? We need some more. We've got one white pansy left. There was some more over here we saw when we were running around. Oh, yellow ones. We'll take them. I think at some point uh, we'll get a bench. I don't know if there's any, like, vertical benches. Because I think it would be cool to put a bench here. But I don't think if there is any. Um... Hmm, that would be so cool if we could just pop a bench there, but I don't think there would be any that way orientated. Let's see. If we go with yellow, white, yellow, white, perfect. Okay, we're going to get our fossils out of our presence before we forget. And this is the balloon present, so it's going to be a balloon table. Always a balloon uh, item. Okay, so now we need our watering can. There we go. Quickly just water these while we're here. Okay, so we've got a public works project going. We're going to have to withdraw some money from the bank. So we need to go up to the post office, I guess. I like to just water in between the flowers. I have no idea if it's of any use, but... Okay, I think we're good. Nice little area. It'll be cool when the tree's grown and the wishing well's there. Uh, maybe we could put something here as well. Have we got any more... 
no more flowers on us, have we? Hey, Jay! Okay, let's head up to Leaf and see if he's got any cool things for sale. And we'll also withdraw some money so we can pay off the uh, public works project. Leaf, I hope you're open! I feel like we must be close to a new upgrade. Uh, welcome! Oh, hey, hey, Amori! I know this will seem real sudden, but today's the end of the line for my little shop here! I heard the supermarket next door starts construction tomorrow. We did not just talk that up! So it seems like a pretty good timing! Anyway, if there's something you need, make sure you buy it today! Ooh, okay. A white lily bag. We're just going to buy it anyway to help Leaf out. Support local businesses. A red pansy bag. Oh, we'll definitely take that. We can go and plant that near the roost. And is this, uh, is this a normal sapling? Yeah. Might as well take that as well. We don't need another axe though. Uh, wait, can you sell things to Leaf? I change the selection of flowers and saplings daily based on what sort of happiness I'm feeling. So I certainly hope that you'll make uh, some time every day to see what I have on display in the shop. Ah. Oh yes, a new upgrade tomorrow. We better check uh, the shop then, because if it's going to be closed tomorrow, we better check what they've got today. Okay, Super T and T, here we come. Welcome, welcome! Today we're holding a special pre-remodeling store closing sale. Wow, that's a mouthful. Oh, you don't yet know what that means, do you? I apologize for how sudden this is, but we'll be closing our shop on February 16th, so that's tomorrow. After that, we'll be closed while we remodel the store. I apologize for the inconvenience. We ask for your understanding as we become an even better store. The best! Uh, oh, cool! Wait, what's this? But this, is this a modern dresser? Uh, we need to get rid of some things. Um, okay, let's put some tools away. The tools take up so much space. Um, okay, let's figure this out here. There we go. A minimalist dresser, a fine item. The price is 1,250 bells. We've now got a back room to decorate as well. So I'm thinking, um, because I forgot that the doors take up space, you can't really have items in front of them. Maybe we could move the min minimalist stuff in the back? Um, is this a minimalist as well? A bathroom sink. That goes really well with it, I think. 600 bells! Bargain! Uh, I'm really intrigued what this is. A vision tester. We're going to buy it anyway, just because it looks kind of cool. Hey, Tex. Sorry, I just bought something. Were you looking to buy? Okay, we may as well check. I don't know if we can get minimalist um, walls and that. But yeah, I think, I really, I don't know, it's so hard. Because the minimalist set really goes well with the 7-Eleven stuff. But I just don't know if we're going to have enough room. A neutral wall. Show me. Oh, is that the same? Is that the one that it comes with? A modern tile. That's what we got yesterday. Oh, we could have got it cheaper today. <laughs> An astro floor. We've already got the astro floor, unfortunately. We've got it literally in our home at the moment. Okay, we don't need anything else, I don't think. Tex, how you doing? Hey, nice to see you. Great shopping, right, Maury? Wish I could live here. So, what can I do for you? What's the latest? I've heard that the supermarket is like a battlefield, but it doesn't seem to be the case in here. You wait until tomorrow, the grand opening. Okay, let's go and withdraw some money. Thank you for visiting. Okay, so we should be able to withdraw some money and just pay off our little public works project. Uh, withdrawal. We've got quite a few uh, bells in the bank. So how much was it? 150,000, wasn't it? So if we just get 100,000 out, it still leaves quite a bit in the bank. And we get more and more each day, which is really awesome. There we go. 
Okay, let's go and pay off this Publix Works project. I think the notice over here will just be about the clock, isn't it? Oh no, attention customers, Super TNT is expanding. Sadly, this means it will be closed on February 16th for necessary remodeling Timmy and Tommy. Ooh, it's so exciting. What's the next one? Super TNT, is it? Uh, it's not the big one, is it? Is there what? There's one in between that, isn't there? Can't remember. Okay, so let's uh, pay this off real quick. Oh look, everyone's gathered. Whoa, what's everyone doing? Why are you all gathering at the campsite? <laughs> Good morning. Hey, contribute to the campaign fund of water well. Our target fund is 148,000 bells. We've collected zero bells. All these villagers here, not one of them has donated a bell. Unbelievable. Uh, don't worry, guys. I got this. Uh, thanks to you, the fundraising target of 148,000 bells has been reached. Please look forward to the completed projects. Awesome. Wait a minute. Did some of the villagers just plant some flowers? You guys. <laughs> awesome. We're going to move them, though. <laughs> They're probably going to be savage that I've moved them, but we're going to move them here. Just to keep increasing the amount of space that we've got for potential hybrids. Okay, I'm not sure what you lot are doing down here. It's kind of weirding me out. I'm, I'm not going to lie. Um, so I think what we're going to do is we're going to extend this path up to the plaza just real quick. Um, so we're going to want the end to be here. Uh, so from the end of the path there. Oh, oh no, I forgot we could place tiles on the actual plaza grounds as well. There we go. <laughs> so we don't need these. I would love to find a pattern for this, these tiles here. That would be so cool. Um, okay, let's just stand this way and we should be able to... I miscalculated! go so it's the one you stand on first must remember there we go so that's pretty cool we're gonna end up having a path around the entire town i think if we need more paths because we can only have 10 designs we need to set up another character just so we can get some more patterns i think um but then we could also extend it all the way up to here maybe all the way up to the bulletin board. I don't know if we're in line. Oh, we're not quite in line, but we could then bring it across here. Maybe extend it over to Tex's house. We've got quite a lot of potential. I like kind of... I like being able to grid things off in sections, because you're quite limited in New Horizons, but... Um, in New Leaf, sorry. Um, but it does mean we can grid areas off like this and plant flowers and have, like... Uh, wells and maybe we could the next big area we cordon off we could put like a, a fountain there or something um, so yeah I think we should probably go and grab our coffee before we before we call it a day oh bunnies in here coffee is the best when it's loaded with lots of nice creamy milk that's how the fancy folks drink it how about some coffee? One cup, 200 bells. One cup, please. All right, then. Uh, freshly brewed and piping hot. Here you are. Thanks. I keep forgetting that to let it cool. We should do that once just to see what they, they say. Ah, the scent and flavour of this coffee is filling every cell of my body. Still hoping to see some special characters in here at some point. Uh, cool, thank you. I think you're beginning to understand the taste I aim for. Would you be interested in working here? I'd pay you, of course. Uh, cool, I'd love that. When you want some work, just talk to me from the counter on the right. You can start tomorrow. Looking forward to... Oh, yes, we can start tomorrow. So that's something to look forward to. Definitely come back and see how that pans out tomorrow. I think for now, there's a good place to call it a day. Um, we just really focused on the campsite area. We've got a new public works project paid for. 
put down and paid for, moved some flowers, built some paths, uh, and, and also we're looking forward to the store upgrading as well. So lots of stuff to look forward to. Thank you, of course, to the channel members and everyone for watching this far. I hope you're still enjoying this series. Uh, thank you for being awesome. Um, you're just awesome, and I, I really enjoy being able to do this. So thank you, and I'll see you next time. Bye!